to my youtube channel my name is Reba, and this is the first review of the year yay to everyone who's back at school welcome back i hope you guys kill your studies this year right that's my first life lesson i'm gonna do life lessons on youtube guys i'm pretty learned. <laughs> i'm kidding <laughs> so this week i'm driving the peugeot 108 it is a a segment car so a segment cars are the cars that come below your polo vivos your yeah polo vivos your fiestas all those budget hatchbacks they, they come below so these are the small cars so this takes on the likes of the Renault quid and the datsun go and no not the datsun girl my mistake Renault quid and toyota igo right yeah Renault quid and toyota igo it and the toyota igo are the exact same car the build the platform similar thing so it is a one liter only has 53 kilowatts of power 90 something 93 newton meters of torque i'll put all the specs in the description box and the price it's priced at 180,000 rand so very affordable but what i like about it is that it's the only car next segment that is um that has six airbags so yeah it's a very very good car in terms of safety they prioritize safety and yeah um driving it is a bit i told myself that i won't be overly critical with the car because it's it's so compact it's so tiny it's so small what what would i gain from just nitpicking at a you know? and i think it's a decent car i would really aim this car to people who are studying like students because the fuel efficiency is amazing i mean it's going back now and i'm on half a tank and i went to kailami for the cars awards so I, I, I did a bit of driving this week and i still have quite a bit of range so great car learner drivers guys you need to learn how to drive and clutch control i think this is those cars clutch i think is soft this you'll learn how to balance and you know accelerate that clutch these are the cars for those so very small car very cute i like it i think it's absolutely adorable has apple carplay and android auto it's a touchscreen um interface so yeah it's very very adorable so i'm just going to show you guys the interior a bit quickly and yeah let's get so to here it. is the interior my unit is purple um the purple color is a bit bright for me i wouldn't really buy this color but it's cute uh, electric windows no central locking unfortunately so and here's the infotainment system that i was telling you guys about so you have a choice to navigate through radio mm -hmm. yfm there so there's bluetooth audio there um so yeah it does have carplay so luckily it's just down here so it's not too far to navigate from remember with my datsun um that thing was literally at the bottom these two these two ports were at the bottom so here you just like bend down yana and i you know store phone you know like proper stuff so you can go back i love the 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 thing again the touch screen is actually quite good quality wise um yeah not really a bad car it's absolutely adorable here's the five speed gearbox and yeah um here is the steering wheel guys um functionality buttons guys a budget card functionality buttons so necessary you know you guys know me and functionality buttons they are so necessary in every car can't do without them and that's the speedometer so on this little screen let me just turn on the car so i can show you properly right on this little screen you guys can see the range you can see if i go there this is my consumption eh, 6.7 damn <laughs> not bad guys i used to do like both seven eight in other cars so 6.7 is totally bad um i do have a heavy foot so yeah and you can see a trip you can see how much mileage it's done there's also the weather and yeah so you just navigate through these two buttons and yeah here's the steering wheel again pressure pressure electric windows yeah very nice little car very nice little car i think it's absolutely cute i'll show you guys the boot space when i'm finished and that is the car for you that's the interior of the car i'll show you the exterior now what i like and what i don't like let me just mention what i like carplay touchscreen the easiness of the 
uh, infotainment system very clear very nice this is a selling point for it the six airbags feature proper stuff nice thing the seats are so comfortable much more comfortable than in a Datsun but the seats are mad comfortable they're so plush they're not like comf comfort comfort but for what you're getting you're getting some form of comfort it's good the drive is not too exciting but it's it's very decent and it's a city car so it does quite well in traffic not really recommended for highway driving but if you're in and out perfect for that this car is perfect if things like that but i long distance driving i don't think it would be quite great loses a bit of power at times but literally i'm not going to be overly critical those are the things that i need to mention but i'm not going to say this is a bad car it's not a bad car at all if you buy this car i, I will not blame you because I mean, I'd get it for myself also if I was looking in this segment because it's so cute, it's so small. Why I say it's perfect for learner drivers, guys, if you can get it right in the yard, that's another life tip for your driver's license. If you can get it right in the yard, chances of you failing go thing very little. So these are the perfect cars for learning how to drive and how to park because they're so small and they're so agile, especially if you're doing code eight. So yeah, perfect little car. It has functionality buttons. Does It just elevates it because it's a budget car with functionality buttons. You guys know me, leave functionality buttons. I mean, I, yo, if a car doesn't have functionality buttons, I would cry. But yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's the car for you. And it has traction control. I was so shocked how I'm put some like, eh, traction control? Haven't used it. The roads are mad wet. I ain't trying to die. I, I didn't use it. So if you guys buy into this car, you'll use it. And yeah, props to Peugeot for making a great comeback into this, um, country um when i went to the Citroen launch the chairman was there and he instilled so much faith in me and i'm i'm very 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 amped to see what Citroen does in terms of sales and the branding and whatever driving this car is a quality product very competitively priced but it's a good product and for them they are so like confident and they just like you know we're gonna come back with a bang and this car is just it's good it's coming in very well for for its caliber i have no quarrels i really have no quarrels maybe just a few tweaks here and there like noise insulation is not too good and um like i said um the drive is not too nice but it's a proper proper car and i'm very like keen on it and i think whoever wants to buy into this car you wouldn't be making a mistake so there are hundreds of budget cars out there so at least you are not uh, you are spoiled for choice so you have endless choices so yeah um yeah 